Ladies and gentlemen, good morning and welcome to Rashi's Camel TV, the tallest man in Black Africa. Iroko Kangata, the Muranga governor, and who is actually the former senator, and one time given the majority leader in the Senate by Uhuru Murei Kenyatta. Iroko Kangata called his members of the county assembly to consult them if he should take the position of the deputy president. And members of the county assembly from Ranga were of the opinion that he should reject the offer. William Samuel Ruto's offer was turned down. William Samuel Ruto went to consult Raila Amoro Diga and Raila Amoro Diga called Irogu Kangata in the Capitol Hill in his office and uh, Irogu Kangata still turned down the offer. A number of UDA tried to call Kangata in a hotel in Nairobi and they tried also to convince him and Irogu Kangata still turned down the offer. Ladies and gentlemen, if you are joining this channel for the first time, please subscribe to this channel if you have never and like the video for our viewers. And I want us to look at Irogu Kangata, the Muranga governor, the rising star in the mountain. Ladies and gentlemen, why is Irogu Kangata becoming very, very popular? But before you look at the reason why he is becoming very, very popular, why did he turn down the offer? Why do you think he turned down the offer? Number one, I just give two reasons. Number one, William Samuel Ruto wanted to diminish, he wanted to blow off the cardo, this, uh, the cardo of uh, Irogu Kangata because William Samuel Ruto does not want any politician for the mountain who is popular with the masses. Number two, Irogu Kangata is a worker, is a workaholic, is a go-getter. And uh, if you look at Irogu Kangata, Irogu Kangata was a councillor. One time he was a councillor. He rose to become uh, a senator and now the governor. And this uh, fear in the corridors of power that he would rise to become the president of the Republic of Kenya. So William Samuel Ruto wanted to hit his head to stop his rising uh, career and popularity. So why is he that popular in Muranga? If you come from Muranga, maybe you can tell us what are these that makes Irogu Kangata very popular. If you look at Irogu Kangata, Irogu Kangata, just like other uh, leaders from Muranga, refused to actually call for the impeachment of Rigali Ashagwa. Actually, he did not want to be associated with the impeachment of Rigali Ashagwa, just like his counterpart in Kiharu, Deni Nyoro, who up to this point has not uttered a word. So, that one make him very, very popular with the people of Moranga because the ground uh, actually is for the, opposi is for the opposition uh, towards Ruto. Ruto should be opposed. Number two, Irugu Kangata has what he call Kangata Care. Kangata Care is a healthy scheme given to the people of Moranga, which actually is far much better than she and Sha, those nonsense of uh, UDA, Sha, Sha, Zui, whatever. And this one, I one time listened to Irogu Kangata talking about she and Sha. And for sure, if you look at what Irogu Kangata is offering to the people of Muranga, it is excellent. Truth be told, Irogu Kangata is working. Number three is that Irogu Kangata is a man who listens to the ground. Irogu Kangata is a hands on governor. Irogu Kangata, you find him with the farmers. Irogu Kangata, you find him uh, at bus stations. Talking with the drivers, you find him with uh, uh, schools, and this one is something that is making him very, very uh, popular. Again, Iroko Kangata used to be uh, seems to be utilizing his funds very, very well. If you look at the number of projects that have been undertaken in Muranga, they are massive. They are many. In fact, he would rival. In fact, do not even compare with what the national government is offering. The county government of Muranga is outshining the national government led by William Samuel Ruto. And most of the projects, like now the roads, if you look at major towns, you see roads. Like now what he's doing, he is coming up with a solar a power whereby major street uh, uh, rights, major roads in uh, towns in Muranga 
will be fixed with streetlight from solar. So this one means that he's utilizing the solar energy. He's going the green way, the green energy. And unlike others who are spending a lot of money, paying Kenya uh, power, encountering a lot of bills so that they can steal the money, Iroko Kangata is not following that route. The other thing is about uh, education. Iroko Kangata provides lunch for so many schools. All the nursery schools, for instance, are given porridge every day, porridge. And he started when he became uh, the governor. So you can imagine that poor parent from Kiharu, that poor parent from Kagema, that poor parent from Maragua, that poor parent from Kabati or wherever, any part, I'm not saying that they are poor, but you see, in, in society, there are those who cannot be able to afford. So you can imagine that kid who goes to school without anything, because many people cannot be able to put three meals on the table. That is the, the, the situation. This is the government of William Samuel Ruto. Many people, even those who, who can afford, they are living from uh, hard to mouth. They cannot afford. So that kid, the fact that he took porridge free is courtesy of Kangata. And you see now, it has become a household name. That is why, you see, because if the kid took porridge, if he ate porridge, when he goes home, that kid will be happy. That uh, kid will be uh, uh, jovial. So, in the uh, final analysis, everybody will be talking about Irogu Kangata. The other thing is that um, when you compare Irogu Kangata with other counties, and I, I also think uh, uh, Kimani Wamatagi, the Kiabu governor, is also working and is fo also following suit. When you look at Irogu Kangata, Irogu Kangata is honest, is sincere. And this one also brings us to the, the Barua, Abayo Ali Mwadikia, Uhuru Mugai Kenyatta, telling him, that the BBI was not popular with the masses. So, even this one, he is very sincere to himself. He's very sincere even to William Samuel Ruto. He's very sincere to the people of Muranga. And he doesn't want to betray the people of Muranga. And he doesn't care what the government will do. So, when you look at him, this is a man with a bright career. This is a man with a bright future. This is a man. I want you to watch very closely, Rogo Kangata. Because if you look at many leaders, Many leaders, uh, stars, have been uh, crumbling. Many leaders in, uh, in this country have been crumbling. You look at uh, William Samoruto. His popularity is going down. In fact, it has gone to the dogs. If you look at Ira Morodega, he has lost the trust of Kenyans. If you look at many other leaders, but now this one, Iroko Kangata, when others' popularity uh, uh, is going down, this man popularity is rising and that's why i'm saying he has a bright future because anybody a, a wise man will tell you the most important thing is not where you come from but where you are and where you are going ladies and gentlemen that's my take please enjoy your day like the video and have a blessed monday bye bye